Voice 1. Why don't we tell secrets in a cornfield? Voice 2. Hmm, I don't know. Why? Voice 1. Because the corn has ears. Get it? Ears of corn. Voice 1. Alright, alright, enough with the corny jokes. Today, we're diving into the wonderful world of cartoons, a place where anything is possible and where corn can indeed listen to your secrets. Voice 2. Cartoons! Ah, the magical realm where animals talk, humans fly and the laws of physics are merely suggestions. A world that has brought us timeless characters, unforgettable stories and yes, some truly terrible puns. Voice 1. Like the corn one. Voice 2. Exactly. But let's not forget, some of our favorite cartoon characters are kings and queens of puns. Think about it, would Groucho Marx be as memorable without his quick wit and pun-laden dialogue? Voice 1. I guess you're right. I mean, who could forget his famous line, One morning I shot an elephant in my pajamas. How he got in my pajamas, I'll never know. Classic. Voice 2. Indeed, humor is a crucial ingredient in the cartoon recipe. It keeps the narrative light-hearted, makes the characters relatable and the stories memorable. And let's face it, we could all use a good laugh. Voice 1. Indeed, laughter is the best medicine, even if it's at a corny joke. Voice 2. Especially if it's at a corny joke. After all, cartoons aren't just about making us laugh, they're about making us think and feel and dream. They're about reminding us of the magic and wonder of the world around us. And sometimes, they're about teaching us to listen, even if it's to the corn. Voice 1. Well, we've certainly had a blast exploring the zany, pun-filled world of cartoons today. And remember, the next time you're in a cornfield, be careful what you say. Those ears are always listening. Voice 2. And on that note, we'll wrap up for today. Thanks for joining us on this animated adventure. Until next time, keep laughing, keep dreaming, and keep